So you want to know what life is like as a digital marketing specialist? Well, welcome to this video. What's up? Holy crap. What's going on guys? Welcome to this video. My name is Alif and welcome to a day in the life of a digital marketing specialist. So one thing I probably have to be really honest with you, it's that uh, my official title is a marketing specialist, but I do everything that a digital marketing specialist does. I work at a payroll software company doing a lot of the, the digital marketing stuff and in this video I'm gonna walk you through exactly what my day-to-day -day sort of looks like. So before I get into the work itself, uh, I usually wake up around 8 a.m. I try to wake up at 6, 7 30 a.m. like I try but I usually I just kind of wake up at 8 a.m. But uh, because of the current state of the world right now, I am working from home. So yeah, Work from home life, not, is it, is it fun? It's, it's not really that fun, is it? And generally when I wake up, I like to make breakfast. So I love Vector cereal. Why? Because it's easy to make, it has high protein and it keeps you full. Vector cereal, love this stuff. So it's about 9 a.m. right now. And generally when I come into the office or I go into work mode and everything, uh, I like to check my emails, check my calendar, understand what my day will sort of look like. Now, of course, uh, I can't show you the screen because, you know, things are kind of private. I might get fired and stuff. So today, uh, I have a meeting with a digital marketing agency that we're looking to run Google Ad AdWords with. And uh, we al I also have a meeting with a video editor that I'm looking to work with in order to create a small YouTube video intro for my company. So let me give you a taste of what are some things right now as of this recording are uh, that are on my to-do list. So right now I have uh, figuring out KPIs for podcasts. I have a blog I got back that I need to look through. So that's another thing I need to create thumbnail templates for our YouTube channel. We're gonna get go harder on YouTube. Okay, so I just realized uh, I have a speaking gig later. Whoa, turn the music down. Okay, right, so I just realized after work, I have a speaking gig I need to do. It's gonna be completely virtual where uh, my university that I went to, they're asking me and other alumni to come by to teach uh, their current students interview tips and tricks for helping them land a job. So I got to text my fitness coach and tell him that, yo man, um, I can't make it to the coaching call today. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Oh my God. Ooh. Okay. So right now, what am I working? What is the leaf, the digital marketing specialist working on right now? Well, my friend, what I'm working on right now is keyword research. Woo! Now, I'm not like a technical SEO whiz, like so pro, 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 pro type of guy when it comes to SEO and stuff. But right now, in that monitor over there, you see right in front of you, I am doing keyword research for a blog uh, we're writing. I'm not going to tell you the details of the blog because I might get fired if I do. So. So right now, I am in a meeting with the marketing agency we're looking to work with right now. So, all right, so it is now lunchtime, 12.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. My favorite part of the day, lunch. So now I gotta make lunch and thank God my mom uh, made some food. I live on my own by the way, but she made me some food and I have them stored in my fridge so I don't have to really cook right now. If you live on your own and you're like a 25 year old single person, then you know exactly what I mean. So, it's lunchtime, and I get to eat, and I'm gonna talk to you. 
How cool is that? Maybe you're watching this whole oh, every freaking time, man. So maybe you're watching this right now uh, and you're a student at university, you're taking a couple of marketing courses and you're trying to get into marketing and you just want to get a taste of what the hell a digital marketing specialist does or maybe you're already, you know, thinking of switching from HR, or supply chain, whatever it is, into the rapidly growing field of digital marketing, whatever your specific situation is. Let me break down exactly what I do on a day-to-day -day basis. So my niche of digital marketing, again, keep in mind there's a lot of a um, lot of lot of areas when it comes to digital marketing. There's like the paid uh, media route. There's like SEO. There's like the content marketing. And just keep in mind when it comes to digital marketing, uh, whether you're looking for a job or trying to network, if you say you know you're a digital marketing specialist, that can mean a bunch of things right so the the niche that I'm under is content marketing uh, I basically do content marketing now what does that mean really so basically for my company it is a smaller SaaS, so software as a product uh, payroll company it has about 35 to about 40 people and I'm essentially trying to grow our marketing department alongside my awesome manager but in terms of my day-to-day -day, let me break down the different tasks that I do as a marketing specialist digital marketing specialist and keep in mind content marketing is what I do so uh, I'm in charge of growing our website traffic through our blogs and I work alongside a blog writer telling her exactly what to write uh, so that you know we can write good stuff on our website so traffic comes to our website you probably saw a little bit of that earlier in this video I manage our social media platforms so Facebook LinkedIn Twitter uh, Facebook LinkedIn Twitter Instagram um, I create content for those social media platforms send them to my manager get approvals and I post them on social media I'm also in charge of growing our podcast we have a we have a podcast, uh, I don't know if I should say the name of the podcast, but whatever, I'm pretty sure if you go on my LinkedIn, you'll find it. But I'm in charge of growing our podcast, that means finding guests for the podcast, editing the audio for the podcast, um, recording the episodes, scripting, creating the descriptions, the cover art, literally everything that is required to grow a podcast, I pretty much do myself. Beyond that, I also do a lot of like our YouTube, trying to grow our YouTube channel, so creating content on YouTube, thumbnails, uh, like a, basically imagine a YouTube content creator, I kind of do that stuff for my job. Other things I also touch on uh, and keep in mind, whoa, and keep in mind that uh, because I'm working in a smaller company, I get to do a lot of different things, which I really like. I like to dabble on different things rather than being super niche and specific. Uh, but the other things I touch on is uh, creating copy for landing pages and making sure all the copy for the landing pages are completely optimized. I create email nurture sequences. Uh, so I create the email campaigns, the copy, the automations, you know, all the technical email marketing stuff. That's also part of my role. But it is lunchtime and I'm starving, so I'm gonna eat. Hey man, so I just finished eating lunch. Woo! And uh, I think I ate too fast because I can feel it right over here, which is not good. Oh man. Anyways, we still have some time for lunch. Let me go on a walk with you. So check it out, this is my building. That's the building. This is the area that I live in. It's kind of nice, huh? And what I'm gonna do right now is head over to the lake and show you what that's kind of like. And also this is kind of weird vlogging outside while everyone's looking at me, so. Alright, and uh, we're back at work. It's now 2 o'clock p.m. I have a call with a video editor we're looking to hire for a video clip thing we want to make for YouTube. So I gotta tell them exactly what we're looking for, providing the brand guidelines, all the fonts, everything we need to do. So 
That should be really, 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 really fun. Is it five yet? <laughs> What a small world, that is crazy. We'll definitely connect to dig this through, yeah, but amazing. Look at that, it's meant to be, right? <laughs> Good to see you, man, man. Yeah, till next time, dude. Cool. Later, guys. All right, bye, everyone. Yo, 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 okay. It is uh, close to five right now, and work is just about to finish. Right now, uh, I have to deliver a presentation uh, or like a speaking engagement on interview prep skills for my university. Jumping right from work to a speaking gig. And 2021, this is what a speaking gig looks like. It's just a laptop and you look at a webinar and you just talk. Isn't that exciting? Ha 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 ha. Describe yourself as an animal. Which animal would you be and why? Maybe I'll choose a, a dog. Yeah, I choose a dog because uh, yes, I, I would follow my owner, or I would uh, <laughs> be loyal. Hello, 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 guys. So what's up? Hello. Are there any alumni here except me? right now. So, so Patricia, I think you did a great job. Couple things I would add on top of that. So, you know, it seems like you're a very thoughtful person. You can communicate well, so kudos to you for that. The things I would add would probably be, if you can use a story and an example, instead of just saying, you know, I would do this. Uh, if you said something like, you know, well, at least that's a great question. It actually reminds me of a time where I have, was in a particular situation did exactly like this in this world. All right, y'all check it out. I just finished the workshop and uh, it was good. No, it was, it was actually good. I, I, I gave interview tips and stuff. But now, my friend, it is time to exercise. It is 7 o'clock p.m. So one thing you should know about me is that uh, I actually really love running. I, I really enjoy it. I find it very meditative. I lost a lot of weight from running. And, you know, I'm actually pretty pumped. Like, I, it's going to be very relaxing. I'm going to have, like, be outside, have the air going through my face, and I can just tune my head off and overall man like running is the best thing ever if you haven't gotten to running you better get into running okay so i'm gonna head out and i'll see you in a bit just finished the 5k i still have a bunch of exercise i need to do So I got my protein shake here. That is it. That is the life of a digital marketing specialist. It's uh, I'm getting tired now, and uh, I've been I've been carrying this camera all day today. And now, my friend, I can put you to sleep and just forget about a darn camera. Okay. So uh, cheers. I hope you learned something. I hope you got some insights into what it is like in the day of the life of a digital marketing specialist. If you do have any questions about marketing and whatnot, uh, be sure to uh, you know let me know down in the comment section what your questions are and I'll try and get back to them. And of course, uh, if you want tips, marketing tips, advice, tricks, career advice, and maybe more personal insights about my life and stuff, yo, grab my newsletter, my marketing newsletter down below in the description of this video. And with that being said, my friend, I'm gonna enjoy the hell out of this protein shake and finally put this dang camera down. I uh, love you and I appreciate you and I will see you in the next, oh, subscribe, 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 subscribe. All right, peace.